Hey guys, I'm Alan with Mr. Z's Music Lessons. Today we're going to be checking out an acoustic guitar gig bag from Kahaya, and it retails for $44.99 on Amazon at the time of making this video, and I'll have it uh, linked in the description if you guys want to check it out. So yeah, they shipped it to me in this big box, so we're going to go ahead and open up this box and see what this case looks like. Here's what the guitar case looks like. I did have to uh, cut some of that out because it took me a while to unfold this thing, but that's what it looks like. This is a reinforced case, so it does have a lot of padding, and it, as you notice, you know, it's pretty thick. And uh, I do really like the gray color. I think it looks really nice. We're gonna take a look at all of the outside pockets just to kind of see what all this uh, thing can hold and everything before we take a look at the inside. So on the outside here, I'll try to hold this up where you guys can see these things. So the first thing here, we have this compartment which uh, they state that this is for guitar picks. It does go down pretty deep. It goes down to about right here or so. Um, so I can't personally fit my hand all the way to the bottom of that. So it may be a little bit tough to get guitar picks in and out of that. Um, but that's what they state that's used for, is for guitar picks. Um, but you could put anything in there, obviously. Um, and then this part, this compartment right here, i open this up to the side here. So they state that this is for a folding music stand. So yeah, it goes down really far. As you can see, it goes all the way down to here. So that's a really big compartment. And yeah, I do definitely think you could fit a uh, folding music stand in there. I don't have one or I would show you guys, but um, yeah, that's a big compartment there. Really useful if you need to carry a music stand around. Then down here we have a uh, compartment that you can put some sheet music in. So notice I just have one book in here. And then also in this compartment, there's a little divider in here that they say you can put like, you know, you could put like your iPad in there and then there's a little cell phone holder over here. And let me see what else we have. I'm zip that back up. Now on the top here, we have a handle. This is really padded, so you know, I don't think you're gonna get tired of carrying this thing or anything. Then on the bottom, we have some uh, shockproof rubber uh, pads there so you can kind of set it down on the ground without hurting anything. And then let's go ahead and look at the back. So on the back here, we have uh, just another thing you can hold this up by. And then they have the backpack straps. And these uh, backpack straps also have this little loop here that holds those in place when you're not using them. So that's really cool. I like that. And these straps, of course, are adjustable so you can uh, make it fit you. And that's really it for the outside. Let's go ahead and open up the case and take a look at the inside. And I should also mention that these zippers feel really nice. They're nice and metal. So one of the first things to mess up on guitar gig bags are the zippers. So I think this one will be pretty good. So if we open this up here, you can see there's a, I don't know how well you guys could see that, but there's a really nice thick padding on this. So your guitar is going to be really well protected. I don't think you'll have any issues there. On the inside here, we have a uh, Velcro like neck strap. So you can put this in the guitar case up here you know, wherever it will fit your guitar. And then uh, you can just, you know, put your guitar neck in there and that'll keep your uh, guitar from sliding around quite as much. So I'm gonna go ahead and grab my guitar and I'm gonna see how well it fits in here. I have kind of a smaller acoustic guitar, so it's probably gonna have a little bit of extra room, but if you have kind of a normal size like Dreadnought guitar, I think it's gonna fit in this really nicely. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and go grab my guitar and put it in here. And this guitar is a Gibson J165 acoustic. So if you've ever seen one or played one, they are you know, relatively small bodied, so they're kind of smaller guitars. We'll go ahead and hook up the next strap here. So like I expected, there's a little bit of room on the sides, but this padding on here is pretty soft, so I would, you know, if I had to, I'd be fine with carrying this guitar in this case. I think it'd be just fine. We'll go ahead and zip this up. And there you have it. Yeah, so my guitar fits in there just fine. I would be okay with carrying it in that case. Well guys, that's gonna wrap it up for this review video. Overall, I definitely give this guitar case a recommendation because it's really nice, uh, it's really well padded. You have lots of uh, pockets there you can store stuff in. 
Um, I have a specific case that's fitted for that Gibson guitar, so you know I don't necessarily need this case that badly. But um, if I needed it, you know I would definitely use it because it is really nice. Uh, don't forget I have it linked in the description if you guys want to check it out. And uh, thanks again for coming and hanging out today, uh, and thanks for watching as always. So I'll see you guys in the next one.